center in Vancouver of Khalistan Random will be dedicated and will be named after Shaheed Talvinder Singh Pramar. Today we are here at the Air India Memorial in Toronto and we all must denounce violence and acts of terrorism. And with my facts and the questions to Indian regime, everyone will know this acts of violence and this act of terrorism was the handiwork of Indian agencies run by RAW. Once again, India is using Air India bombing and labeling Khalistan as an act of terrorism. While everyone knows Khalistan is a political opinion. We are here today at the Toronto Air India Memorial site. For three decades, successive Indian regimes is insulting the family members of the victims of Air India 1985. They are blaming Shaheed Talvinder Singh Parmar for bombing Air India. Today we are going to discuss some facts and there will be questions that will be asked to Indian regime and they must come clean on that. In 1985, when Air India bombing happened, Canadian agencies investigated Talvinder Singh Parmar. He was never charged, never convicted. He stayed in Canada from 1985 to 1988 when he traveled back to India, where he was arrested, extrajudicially killed, and was tortured. If Pai Parmar was involved, why did India kill him extrajudicially? Why they did not convict him? Why they did not let the world know that they have the bomber in their hand? Because Pai Talwinder Singh Parmar was never charged and convicted. That's why. Now coming to another accused. For three decades, successive Indian regimes told that Ripu Daman Singh Malik, he was involved in Air India bombing. Let's discuss about Air India bombing and Ripu Daman Malik. We are going to ask questions and India must respond. If Ripu Daman Malik was involved in Air India bombing, why did you let him in India in 1994? Why you did not file any charges, any criminal case? against Ripu Daman Malik. Why your banks, Indian banks gave a 200 million dollar line of credit to run Ripu Daman Malik, his credit union. And again, few years later, why he was a state cast of Indian agencies raw. All this leads to that Air India bombing was done by Indian agencies. When Canadians investigated 1985, they did not charge Shahid Pramar. They removed diplomats from Canada, Indian diplomats, including Aluwalia, including Bridgeroff. They were removed and sent back to India for their role and their hand in Air India bombing. On November 6th, we are doing Khalistan referendum right here in Toronto, while next center in Vancouver of Khalistan referendum will be dedicated and will be named after Shaheed Talvinder Singh Pramar because he was never convicted never charged for Air India 1985 bombing. India is creating fear-mongering in the minds of the Canadians so they can stop a democratic and peaceful process of Khalistan referendum. The question is, India, why do you fear a vote? Because majority of the Sikhs in Canada and in Punjab seek liberation of Punjab from the Indian occupation through Khalistan referendum, a democratic and peaceful process. And Sikhs were justice is going to continue the Khalistan referendum.